I think that Dr. Ginez is going to explain a little bit about the advantages and limitation of uh, uh, endoscopic ultrasound and MRI. The, that is, it seems that is a non-metastatic patients. And what is the, the, the strategy that you would recommend to, to perform a clear and nice uh, st local staging of this patient? Yes. Uh... As you said, the, the most important thing is to rule out uh, distant metastases, and this is logical and nobody is discussing this. Uh, if there are no distant metastases, like in this case, then we, we can, it's possible to choose in be between the two techniques I explained before, uh, which are MRI and EUS. Um, I would say MRI, uh, as I show you also, uh, has this and US have the same perform almost the same performance characteristics in T and N stage, uh, but there is one m m big advantage of MRI, which is the uh, it is able to see the mesorectal fascia, and this is very important uh, in order to to planify or to to to, to know uh, how the the surgery uh, will will be. No. Uh, Unfortunately, we cannot see, I'm saying we because I'm EUS uh, <laughs> people, uh, we can see the mesorectal fascia, EUS. And so if we compare, I would say nowadays, uh, mo in, in most of the centers, uh, probably uh, MRI has to be chosen instead of EUS because of this advantage. However, uh, um, there are f some exceptions. For example, it, this is not the case because this tumor uh, was a T3 tumor, not, not very big T3, but uh, already T3, so the patient would go to neoadjuvant therapy. But if, if it w had been uh, T2 and we, s we see a lymph node, then uh, the, the, if the lymph, no lymph node is metastatic, uh, the treatment may change. Uh, so in this case, I would say, and I, I would really, I'm, I'm convinced that USFNA is mandatory uh, to send the patient uh, to surgery if it's negative or to uh, neoadjuvant therapy if it's positive. Uh, well, that, that's, that's the, yeah, the point. That's in this case, I think the, the, in this particular case, the, the tumor was far from the, uh, from the recta, mesorectal fascia, mm. and there were some lymph nodes uh, seen uh, in, in both in both uh, techniques, in, MRI and, and US. And for a proper evaluation of this lymph node, you would recommend a fine needle aspiration well, biopsy? Well, in this case, I don't think it's mandatory because uh, the, 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 the tumor the, is already T3. I mean, uh, that is so not going to change the, 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 management. the management, exactly.